In this video, I'm going to show you all the tools you need to create courses online. There are seven main stages when it comes down to creating courses online. Research, outlining, design, recording, editing, hosting, and promoting. Let's start with the tools that you need to do your research. Before spending hundreds of hours creating an online course, you want to make sure there's a demand for your topic. On Google, search for your topic plus online course. So if you're teaching yoga for moms, type yoga for moms plus online courses on Google. Look at what's available and find a way to differentiate yourself from your competition. If you don't find a single course covering your topic, that could be a sign of no market or too niche of a market. To see what's popular, you can type your topic followed by four and check the top suggestions on Google's search auto-suggest list. Another great way to know what's in high demand is using Google Trends. Enter two or three keywords to see how popular they are. Here, we can see that yoga has been declining in popularity since 2014, meditation has been steadily increasing, and anxiety has been on a faster upwards trend since 2010. Yoga for anxiety would be a good niche to tackle. Outlining. For outlining, you can use pen and paper, a spreadsheet, or project management software like Notion, Trello, Asana, or Basecamp. I like to use a spreadsheet and use color coding to see which lessons are completed and which ones are left to record. Design. This is where you create or gather any digital assets to be used in your course. For stock photos and videos, check pexos.com, pixabay.com, Envato, and Storyblocks. To create slides, you can use PowerPoint, Google Slides, or Keynote. Recording. For this part, you'll need a camera, microphone, and lights. On the cheap end, you can use your smartphone or a webcam as your main camera and go up from there. Using a DSLR or mirrorless camera with detachable lenses, like the Panasonic GH5, Sony A6400, Canon 90D, or equivalent. Ideally, a camera with a flip screen so you can set up your shot without help. For audio, you can start with the Samsung Go and then upgrade to the Yeti, a wireless lavalier microphone like the Rode, or a shotgun mic like the Audio-Technica AT-A75A. For lighting, you can choose among many LED kits. Make sure they're dimmable and ideally that come with three lights. To avoid unwanted echo, make sure your recorded room is sound isolated. You can use audio isolating panels from Amazon. Video editing. After recording your lessons, you will have to fix any mistakes, adjust the audio levels, and optionally superimpose titles and graphics. The most popular tools for video editing are Final Cut Pro for Mac users, Adobe Premiere for Mac and Windows users, and DaVinci Resolve for both Mac and Windows users as well. If you want something simpler, I highly recommend Camtasia or ScreenFlow, which combine both screen recording and video editing in a single package. Hosting. For hosting, you can either host your courses yourself or upload them to a marketplace like Udemy or Skillshare. For self-hosting, the most popular platforms are Teachable, Thinkific, and Kajabi. If you want to use WordPress on your own server, then LearnDash is a popular solution among online teachers. Promoting your course. The best promotion tool for online teachers is YouTube. You can upload a series of free educational videos on YouTube and then add call to actions to your courses in your videos and video descriptions. A great idea is to send leads from YouTube to a landing page and collect email addresses. Then, once you've built a list with 100 or more prospective buyers, you can launch your course to them. To manage your email list, you can use tools like MailChimp, ConvertKit, or SendFox. You can also use paid ads on Facebook, YouTube, Google, or Instagram. But before you spend any money on ads, make sure you have a solid course and have done plenty of testing on your sales funnel to avoid wasting a lot of money. And that's it. That's all the tools you need to create and sell online courses. For a more in-depth tutorial on how to create courses, make sure to watch this video here. Yes, right here. Just click on it and you'll see 60 minutes of me teaching you how to create an online course. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.